So I, I uh, had an opportunity to spend some time with the Pacifica out in California. I drove it around with, uh, with my children. Uh, I really, really like this vehicle. It's, I think it, it actually, I think it's going to sell pretty well. Uh, the thing that was surprising to me, I, I expected the, the uh, nine speed to perhaps be an issue and I, uh, as it's been in other vehicles, and I tested it as hard as I could and I could not get it to misbehave. Uh, I think this is the first vehicle that, that uh, FCA has made with this powertrain combination where they really got it dialed in correctly. Uh, in terms of what I, I could only find one thing that I didn't like, and that was the, uh, the physical location of the shifter knob in, in the middle of the center stack. It, it gave me pause every time I wanted to turn on the radio or turn up the volume on the radio, uh, but you can't when you're, sh when you're driving, it won't let you shift like that anyway. So uh, it's not really a safety concern, it just takes training. So I don't think it'll be an issue. What did your kids think? My kids loved it. You know, I uh, wrote a story earlier. When you're doing a minivan, the back seat, developing the back seat is really almost more important than the front seat. And in this case, the, the, rear, the rear passenger compartment is really good. Uh, I love the amenities, they loved the amenities. Uh, the seats were, were far more comfortable than previous generation minivans, uh, which was a big problem. Stone go is easier now. That was, that was kind of a nagging issue with the previous generation. Uh, physically, I, th I think the design is much, much more fluid. It's uh, much more attractive, and uh, it doesn't look like a mini. Boy, I, you know, I give it a probably a nine seven, right? The German judge is always a stickler, right? <laughs> but I, I, I think overall, I, I think I give it a nine seven. It really is a very good mini.